Chuck Fresh with a review of the Logitech K780. It's a little pricey, but it's a bad butt keyboard. There's a little weight to this thing. It's hard to pick up with one hand. Hard to tell, obviously, from this, but it's pretty solid. It's got a lot of weight to it, and there's a reason for that. It's got this bad butt little backdrop, which is pretty cool. What a lot of people don't realize is you could sync three devices, including an iPad over Bluetooth. So now you've got a full-size keyboard with a number pad, not those stupid little cheesy keyboards we're talking about, but a full-size keyboard. And check it out. A full... You can actually type on your iPad now, which is really cool. And Again, it's Bluetooth connectivity, which is amazing. It's ubiquitous. It's everywhere. I don't mind all my stuff here. I teach uh, small kids in the background. Uh, but yeah, you can put a full-size keyboard on your iPad, which now makes your notes or whatever you put Word on your iPad fully functional. Um, not those silly little chiclet keys that are hard to type, but you can actually tear up with this thing. It's full-size keys. They're round. Um, it's not backlit, which I had hoped it was, but that would be a battery sucker too. It is wireless, which is nice. You can move it anywhere you want. And then when I want to change to my computer, I just hit the... Uh, I've got my stuff all configured here. So I'm going to change it to my computer. And now I can just bounce here and then uh, start typing on my computer. So, yeah, up to uh, three devices, man. You could even put it on your smartphone, which I'm using right now. I can't show you, but, yeah, three devices with the three function buttons. And uh, Logitech now comes with some pretty nifty software. Let's see if I can find it really quick where you can program some of the keys, including the function keys, and uh, tell it what you want this keyboard to do. It does updates automatically. I'm running this on Windows 7. Or you could use the F1, F12 keys as standard function keys, which I use a lot, or you could use these special little things here, your home, and you, I think you could do some assignments on these too. I haven't really fooled around with it. But yeah, a nice little keyboard. Uh, it has a unifying receiver too. So if you have a Logitech mouse, you can actually synchronize your mouse to use the same receiver as your keyboard which is really helpful, helps save some USB ports. If you use a lot of them like I do, that can be really helpful. So, yeah, I'm digging this thing, man. Logitech uh, K780. Again, a little pricey, but a uh, nice little keyboard. It responds really well. I haven't had any hiccups or uh, connection problems. I've been using it for about a week now, and a uh, nice little keyboard. Highly recommend it.